make up what those things should be. I have no right to say what a certain country or culture or region should or shouldn't do. So it's like, but I can give you the tool to get that across. So we look at constitution, we look at UN agreements, things like that, and then base base our content. I'm not going to say messages. That's a bad word in this room today. You don't talk about messages. You talk about content. You talk about values. So what are the values that are trying to get across? And then that, and then that's what we base our content on. So I'm hoping these video clips work. Um, Hello, novellas. Maybe a, a, a kind of maybe maybe new for some of you, or those of you who may know the term may have a certain idea of what a telenovela is. Telenovela is different than the American soap opera. Big difference is that they end. American soap operas don't end. <laughs> unless, unless they, they came the radio. So the, the young and the rest of us, or whatever it's called, <laughs> it's been on for maybe 40 years. You know, the ball is beautiful, or whatever it's called. Um, you know, again, they're on, and they just keep returning those storylines. So if you were watching it, you know, when you were in, in, in um, college, your kids are watching the same storylines because they just revamp them. Telenovelas in the classic Latin style end. They're designed to end. And we use that, as you'll see in a second, because you need that ending for the protagonist to make a journey. But I'll just go back to the, the pioneer of this approach, which was uh, a Mexican producer called Miguel Sabido. Um, and when he started this whole um, approach, this is what he said about why he uses telenovelas. No hay instrumento en el mundo mejor para solucionar los problemas sociales que la telenovela.
Cuando en 1964 dije que yo quería encontrar el uso social de los medios masivos de comunicación para ayudar a resolver los grandes problemas de mi país y después del mundo entero, todo el mundo se rió de mí. Y que no estás loco, la televisión, el radio, el cine, son para entretener solamente. Ah, sí, claro, los exquisitos dicen, la telenovela es despreciable. Es despreciable, ¿por qué? Porque la ve la chusma, porque la ve eh, las multitudes. Bueno, esas multitudes son las que van a solucionar realmente los problemas de la humanidad. Tenemos la solución para que en 15 o 20 años bajar a la pobreza en el mundo entero, bajar a la explosión demográfica, bajar a los pobres, bajar el, el, el estado de desesperanza en el que se encuentran dos mil millones de seres humanos, dos mil millones de seres humanos, esto es mucho, esto es muchísimo verdaderamente. La única forma de resolver los problemas de la humanidad es enseñándole a las grandes multitudes una conducta adecuada para resolver los problemas. ¿Y cómo se puede hacer eso? A través de la telenovela. aprende a decodificar muy fácilmente las telenovelas porque desde el principio sabe quién es bueno y quién es malo ustedes pueden dividir los personajes en dos tipos los buenos y los malos bueno, eh, yo lo que agregué fue un tercer tipo de personajes que son los personajes de duda los que están dudando entre lo bueno y lo malo
and you do all that extensive research to learn about who that person is, and also to understand the positives and negatives that are influencing that person. It's not like they wake up one morning and decide to buy ivory or you know, have shark fin soup. Somebody's telling them that that's a, a cool thing to do or a good thing to do. And that would be a negative character in part of this. By the way, folks, we're playing God. We're determining who's positive and negative. That negative character doesn't think that what they're doing is wrong or bad. And they have all kinds of justifications <coughs> for why what they're doing makes sense. You know, the, the, tiger, the tiger bones are powerful ambulance. Um, you know, the shark fin soup it tastes really good. You said that yesterday. Positive characters are also giving this transitional character an influence. So we can go to this. So this is what it looks like. This is your audience way down here. And you've designed your transitional role model based on that. So they, they, that transitional role model is as like these folks as much as possible the way they dress, the way they eat, the way they think, and especially the way that they interact with your issue. Now, the positive and negatives can be more stereotypical. Of course, they're still going to be culturally, um, linguistically relevant to your audience. But as you see, it's this person, it's this transitional role model who has a journey. And another thing really key, this one and this one, especially this one, are not the role models for your audience. That one is, because he's most like you. And he doubts. And another thing you'll see from this, these are choices. Transitional role models don't always make positive choices. Sometimes they make negative choices. Sometimes they make good choices. And this is what we do based on what they, if I could choose something. There you go. No, I'm actually the next one. So this is what their choices will look like. I call them triggers. And all a trigger means is that a transitional character is walking through life, through the status quo, having a good time, doing whatever they're doing, and something happens. Call it an incident. And that incident is not necessarily caused by the transitional character. It could be just something that happens to them. A, a parent dies, they lose a job, um, wife divorces and lose a job, just something happens. So if you like, think of a T-junction. And you're walking along, you can't go straight anymore, you have to make a decision. And just as I'm about to make that decision, Magically, that's where the positive and negative characters come in. And the positive character is telling me, go right, this will, this will get, get you where you want to go. And then the negative character is telling me the same thing. They both think they're correct. The way I, I think of it, I travel a lot, and I always get lost. I'm always lost. I got lost in the hotel room. Yeah, I don't know how that in my, own, in my own hotel room. Um, so, but, so I'm always getting lost. And then making a character, so I, I get to the team dungeon, and I say, oh, uh, Nana, excuse me, I'd like to go to a grocery store. Do you know one nearby? And she looks at me, and she thinks, oh, she doesn't want to go to 7-Eleven. She wants to go to a really nice grocery store, right? So she says, about 10 blocks that way, there's a grocery store. Oh, thank you very much. Thank you. So you know, I'm like, okay, I'm going to go to that grocery store. Then I see this young girl, she's kind of chat. Do you know if there's a grocery store nearby? And she says, oh yeah, there's a 7-Eleven right across the street. Now, she didn't give me bad information to punish me. She thought she was giving me what I wanted. She also thinks she's giving me what I want. In our God universe that we created, she's my positive character. She's actually probably you. Does that make sense a little bit? Okay. So now if you can go back once more. This is what you're going to do. As I said, we do all kinds of formative research. And I hope I'm... Normally this takes me a month with script writers. And I'm trying to do this in half an hour. So bear with me if there's 
Lots of stuff I'm just jumping over. This is how we create those three characters. Get it? Positive, negative. Who do you think this one is? Transition, right? Or only for yourself. That's your, it's your desired behavior change. It's the journey you want your transitional character to take. Because if your transitional character takes that journey, who hopefully will follow? The masses, your audience, the mob. <laughs> okay? But this is what this is what we give you. We give you these two. That's all that formative research that we do. So give something like a what. And a what is a is a fact. It's a factoid. No opinions, it has a number or it has a percentage. I'm sorry, this is from, from family planning, but it's the one I have, so it's the one you get. It's it's there's no no discussion about that. So somebody went out and measured it and found out that in this country or in this region, there's a low use of contraception. Formative research looks at this. Okay? So the formative research says why. And a, a why is an opinion. So for a why, I need to go out and talk to people. And the people that I'm talking to are your audience. So that I can design that one on the bottom. That's what I'm looking at. Why are you guys doing this? Or why aren't you doing this? In this case, why aren't you using contraception? Then I take that and I say, okay, let's take, let's take this one or something. So my positive characters would say, no, actually, couples should be discussing family planning. That would be a good thing for them to do. But these guys say, ah, I'm the end of the puzzle. What I say goes, we're not going to talk about it. So, and then what is our desire to be here change is that people start talking more and more about family planning. Does that make sense a little bit? Because the example that I'm going to give you is completely different. And I want you guys to work in two groups. You guys are separate back there. I'll come talk to you in a sec. So the, the Samir group, as I call them, just hang out for a sec. What I'd like you to do, we did this study, actually, and I brought along formative research. Fortunately for you folks, I've condensed what was being maybe, you know, 100 pages of formative research into about three quarters of a page. Because I didn't think we would have time to read 100 pages. So it's the same, they're copies. So everybody in your group, if you guys can get in one or the other group, that would be great. Just join a group, because I'd like to do two. We don't have time for three. And what you're going to do is read through the formative research. And you're going to design, you're going to design your character based on your formative research. The senior group doesn't get formative research, okay? You guys, I'll come talk to you. So what I want the groups to do is to look at your look at your formative research. No, you don't get this. Tell me you who you this. think of positive character. You don't get this. Who you think the negative character would be? And who do you think your transitional character would be? So I need to know things like male, female, what's the occupation of that person, what do they do, what do they think? And I'll give you guys just 10 minutes. Is that enough? 15 minutes. 15 minutes. I'm going to give you guys 15 minutes. Because she doesn't trust us. Why? Probably. Samir's group, don't worry yet. I'm coming. Don't worry. Don't worry. Yeah. I'm not that yet. Yeah. So you people are your Your wedding time starts in two seconds. Because of your medication, your baby will be average. Yes. He's under influence. That's right. I am under influence. He's in transition. He's not sure which direction. He's in a limited state. He has to do anything to do with saving the blockchain up against you. Please don't. You're going to need to put your book on. Right? Two people that they do it. Can you interview on camera? It's like you want to wipe. I don't know what I will say. Jesus must be good at this today.
I've never had a reaction like this from a it's, it's like my whole head is wrapped in a wet towel, and, and everything seems like slowed down. And it's it's semi it's can't focus on anything. It's, it's, are you guys clear on what to do? I'm starting to off. People spend millions on getting this on stage. This might be the time to have you sign some documents. Do you guys okay over here? Good. And then I'm He was just dragging around. Okay, special task group. Yeah, the dance of the moon. Special task group. You are the special task group. You are the special task group. So when you are going to go, you So around these two centers, one is the hunters of the hunt. Um, so we need to use this because we get a lot of money. And people eat the fish meat because the fish is not good. Why would you guys do this? But these guys are doing this. Because they're just going to fight out the red ones. I want you guys to do that. You were right. <laughs> so so you, I've given you more than you need. You need at least three characters. And I want you to show uh, what is the person that's going to do. Like a transitional character has to be a constant choice. I know I'm putting it on. So in other words, the transitional character is like, hmm, what should I do? And the negative character comes along and says, oh, you should do this. You know what that is. <laughs> And this is for and then the positive could be but they both try and influence the transition. Exactly. And the transitional character makes a choice. And then and then either it's punished or rewarded. By who? By the situation. So it could be for example, for example, lots of water. This water is safe to drink. She comes along and says, oh, yeah, it's all right. She's got it out of my well. She comes along and says, no, 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 no. Well, water is not as important. If you drink it, what's going to happen? That's what you've got to show. So what's going to happen to my transitional character? Wait, we're actually acting? Yeah. yeah. I think a minute will be fine. Okay. <laughs> Wait, why did I walk in? <laughs> <laughs> You can be the director. Okay. But, I'd be what do you what are you gonna get a chair and one of the sisters? What what I come up? Yeah. Oh no, because you won't have to you're gonna do it right. So you guys are gonna have to do it. But use their same example. So it's either you're gonna pick up or you're gonna take the one or two other sitting Hunting, which made this into the endangered species, it's like gorillas and chimpanzees, and also the person. So it's very, uh, yeah. Uh, also, there's a potential disease that they show. So there are some. I've picked on him. Starting with. Just yell at him. Someone has to be a moral compass in the story. Let her turn back. Let's go to the hunter because you can show the consequences more easily. Then the fourth character can be the police guy and comes and arrests. You can talk about the budget and exactly the money that you can make for tourism. No selling of meat, right? A hunter. A hunter is like, I mean, if they're not doing, if they're not hunting, what are the consequences? What are the consequences? What are the consequences? Ah, okay. Alternative occupations. Yeah. So if we're going with, uh, with uh, 
uh, financial motives that we got. So why would he have been uh, hunting in the first place? So maybe it's, um, it's cheaper. Uh, like I need to feed, you know, you need to feed your family, and it's it's much cheaper and quicker if you just do it this way. I've been doing it for many generations. I'm the mean, fourth generation hunting in family, and I'm not making lots of money. And I'm, really not, and I'm good at that because my father said that father did not Exactly. So you're, you're expressing that. Yeah. Now. Yeah. 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 Not an active expression. Yeah. 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 I'm good at it. I've been doing it. My my main four fathers have been doing it for many generations, and I grew up doing it. Intergenerational. My identity. I'm known for it in the society. I'm the best. I'm the best. It's a, it's a sign of masculinity. Yeah. I'm going to say that I, 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 so we got the highlight of the word. That's what they say. Negative as well. 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 Someone asked, is it's their family? So if it's, as we said, if you're the man, you're the hunter, you're providing for your family, well, until you get arrested and thrown in jail for illegal poaching, and now you're not going to be able to provide for your family. And your family you're going to have that impact by you. Like, so the positive character should actually have both on the so I think she was suggesting that maybe she comes up to this guy. And uh, maybe that person occupies the best skills and starts becoming a handicap. Or a chicken farm. Chicken farm. And then what's the problem? You can take the The positive character should be two things. And then the consequences and provide some alternative solutions. And say, I can help you with that. There's a special scheme by the government. So then uh, to be, if the person decides to do the right thing, then there's no the role for the car. I'm getting arrested. If the person takes the wrong decision, then we have to show up as a cop and leave in the company to remind them like the, the positive guy is a cop. The positive guy is a cop. I don't Not necessarily, but it could be a reinforcer. Yes. A buddy. A buddy. Just, just to make them out of five minutes. Just to give everyone a call. Somebody's got to be the cop. Let's have a. Let's, let's take the wrong story. Let's take the wrong story. Let's take the wrong story. 
it's so little time it might be more straightforward to just have him make the wrong decision okay. and, yeah. and then get arrested and see the consequences from it. Will the big no, no, arrest. Arrest, no, no. beating, no death. Court, court trial. I mean, who wants to get no, beaten? No, no. Real demonstration. No, no. This, this guy is in the trance anyway. Like, <laughs> oh, everyone gets a job. Everyone gets a role. Like, like, yeah, they're getting, they're getting exposed. That's the sub for tomorrow. <laughs> To be yeah. That's right. Part two. Part two. Are you okay? Um, we don't know. Okay, now comes the hard part. Hunter has nothing to say, right? I can do that. <laughs> <laughs> What we haven't talked about is we have to be an incident. What, what, what's the thing that's on? So I like to do the word arrow? Probably not using it. It's semi-automatic. It's probably... No, Kalashnikov? Yeah, shotgun. I think it's an incident with me that it's all And he's trying to hunt with me. Oh boy, it sounds difficult. So he's out there uh, with these two friends, yeah. and they're all, you know, together. And so they're all maybe hunters, but they see this particular species where the good, the good. Like, no, no, not no, not, not that one. Like, you know, that can get you in real serious trouble. You know, this is, you know, and, you know, and then the other ones. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So they're they're all hunters, right? But. So then we don't have a transitional person. I think the transitional is that just like, you know, the good and evil on the side behind him telling what to do. But are they actually there? Or are they we don't show a third person. Mm -hmm. So that should be the... What if you think if you are you know, the hunter in this category and you have two people on the side, you say... Okay, guys, you have like four more minutes left. No, we should show them. Just yeah, there, right? so Our right. audience is not very smart, so they need to show them. <laughs> <laughs> Who's the, uh, the good and evil behind your mind? Oh, so I'm already in the, yeah, you're in the game. Yeah, yeah, you're in the game. But I'm getting over there. Who's saying you're the transition character? Yeah. The transition character. And that would be... Yeah. Okay, because we're, so we're saying, we're not saying hunting is bad. We're yeah. saying hunting is specific yeah. animals. Yeah. Yeah. So it is bad. The choice would, the choice would be... Uh, yeah, so just to deer or, or And maybe you're saying, like, I need that. Yeah, okay. Gorilla Rose. Who's favorite bird? 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 I could be the I could be the bad influence. Come natural to you? Today at least. Jealousy, you can be the good influence. <laughs> 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 
Yeah. 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 So yeah, we're the we're the we're the crying family. Right? Yeah. So you have a baby with his son, right? Yeah. So do I put eyes at the end, or am I? What's my role? I think that we. You are the you are the bubbly teenager. And you're going to hear that with another little child going, please, mom, I want some more. Like, oh, we don't have any more food because your father got arrested. I think you're going to hear that with another little child going, please, mom, I want some more. Like, oh, we don't have any more food because your father got arrested. Oh, so you're the one. Okay. 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 Oh, so you're the one.
you don't hunt that chimpanzee, somebody else will, and they'll get the money. Ooh. So he's actually trying to help the transitional character, right? But, and there's other things like there's a demand, I need to feed my family, um, there's a tradition, et cetera, et cetera, et cetera. But the positive character has a good point. One, it's against the law. Yeah, you may make a lot of money, but if you get caught, then your family is, is sunk because you'll be in jail and you won't be able to support them at all. And the whole idea of extinction of species. You keep hunting this, they're gonna go away. Another thing that you could put in a positive character's um, repertoire would be actually, if you work as a community, we can make more money by saving these guys because you guys brought this up, tourists will come to our community and they'll pay us money just to look at them. So you want to keep them there so that people pay money. Now let's get to you guys real quick because you, you focus more on this. You're a transitional character, if I can, I'll just um, summarize for you. So their transitional character was a woman, a wife, right? And so she's, she's like making the food and her husband, who happens to be the negative character, is saying to her, I want meat, man must eat, right? <laughs> and he's, he's demanding this chimpanzee, this gorilla food, because for him it's a sign of luxury, it's a, a status symbol, and he's also saying, and it tastes better. Like, don't feed me chicken, that doesn't taste the same way that this chimpanzee does. Mm. But now that they've done this, they've chosen another woman for the positive character to influence this woman, right? She's gonna have to be equally powerful to the transitional as the male. So probably like a, a very good friend, someone this, this woman encounters a lot. We've made her slightly more educated so that she can talk about things like the protein value of other needs. She can talk about social responsibility. So she's got a little bit more information than our transitional character does. So in a nutshell, you guys just did about, usually takes like two weeks. So you just did two weeks of work. <laughs> just really quickly, and then um, Universal Pictures, can you come up and get ready? And then I'll tell people what you guys are doing. So, Chinese people. We were talking about the but you can't work without the Exactly. And uh, we, we are now very certain about how to put up that or that you know, exactly. So we think that um, the government will uh, take this from the market. Mm -hmm. The government will buy it out to make it um, natural. So the um, like a national park or zoo, so the houses will have that. Exactly. Perfect. And the the uh, that divider is with just that. Yeah. Than the area. So yeah. you can't be here. Yeah, you can't be here at all. But then, then you're gonna sneak in. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, the oh, then there will be like other place. Yeah. What's your yeah. House? So come up, you guys. While I'm finishing up, just get yourself up here because this is your stage. Okay. This special group was given a task a little bit more difficult than I think even like on your knees. They had to not only come up with the transitional positive and negative, but they're going to add down what happens. So they're going to go through. They're going to go through. Absolutely. They're going to go through the trigger. Okay, so what they're going to present to you, and you're going to grade them to see how they did. Yeah. So you're going to finish this. This is a non-speaking meeting. This is a non-speaking meeting. So guys, so um, what they're going to do is they've decided who their positive, negative, and transitional are, and they're going to walk through one trigger. So they're going to present an incident. The positive, or the positive and negative characters try to influence the transitional, right? Transitional makes a decision. We don't know if it's positive or negative, but then there are consequences to that decision. That's one thing I forgot to talk about with the consequences of that decision. So, for example, if we're talking about safe drinking water, and I, I, get, a, I get a glass of water and, and I ask, is it okay to drink? And she says, fine, it just came from my well, go ahead and drink it. And she says to me, to pick on one of you, she says, don't drink that water, it needs to be boiled and you know it's not safe. And if I decide to drink it, what kind of a decision have I made? 
That would be a negative decision, right? So what's going to happen to me? I'm going to get sick. Please. Probably not die, but <laughs> or, or I'll have diarrhea or I'll, I'll get sick. So that's the way that a trigger works. So Universal Productions presents the Bushmeat story. All right, so. <laughs> okay. So we're going to, oh, this, okay. Um, we're going to introduce you to the pictures, uh, sorry, our characters first. Uh, so I just Don't tell us who they are, though. Uh, yeah. Don't tell us. Just act it out. Yeah. Yeah. Just act it out. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> no narration. <coughs> All right, it's time for me to go somewhere now. Uh, you haven't had breakfast yet. We have not eaten. Uh, uh, what did you just do? Uh, uh, my 
friend. What do you do? I don't want to talk to your friend. I don't want to talk to you. You've got the gun in your hand. Is that a dead gorilla? You know gorillas are protected species, man. What do you think happens? You shoot a gorilla. You come with me. Yeah, can I, uh, oh, can I, 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 can Please come, take your bow, positive character. Uh, Who was the positive character? Woo! Is that right, folks? Is that what you thought? Yeah. Who was the negative character? <laughs> and what were their arguments? What was the positive character saying? Tourism. We love our forest. We love our forest. We see how beautiful it is. They'll bring money. Yeah, and they'll bring money to us. And what was the negative character saying? Think of your family. What was the negative character saying? Meat tastes good. Meat tastes good. Money today. And did you traditional? And do you do you think that he was conflicted? Do you think he was trying very hard to make a decision? You could see at one point he held his head. He's like, I I don't know what to do. Took him a long time to decide, a little bit longer than the scene. But uh, anyway, and what was what kind of a decision did he make? Did he make a positive decision or a negative decision? A negative decision. So what happened to him? Punishment. Okay, there was a consequence, and he got taken away. And who were these nice young people on the side here that are hiding behind the flip chart? The family. That's what we call secondary characters. Very necessary because without them, he doesn't have any motivation. So well done, Universal Pictures. That's it, folks. It's lunchtime. If you if you want to learn any more about this, I'm happy to exchange with you. Gorilla <laughs> meat. Gorilla meat for lunch. Thank you so much, everyone. You guys did great. I need to Well done. Thank you. Well done, you guys. That was amazing. <laughs>